Is wood heat like actually cheaper? Yes. Is wood heat like actually cheaper? Yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Obviously, it's gonna depend on, you know, where you live. So I'll explain a little bit about where I live. There is electric heat, but electric heat is not even worth it. Electric heat is so expensive. Almost everyone that I know heats with a wood stove. For here, yes, wood heat is the cheaper alternative. If you are considering if wood heat is gonna be cheaper for you, because it's obviously gonna depend on where you live, there are a couple things to consider. I think the first thing to consider is permitting. Do you need a permit to put a wood stove in your house? Where I live, you don't need a permit at all to have a wood stove in your house. That's just how common wood heat is out here and how much people need it is that if people had to wait four or five or six or seven or eight months for a permit for their wood, like it's just, it's not acceptable. So here you don't even need a permit at all for a wood stove, which is cool. Uh, but that is not the case everywhere. The second thing um, is based on your permitting. You're gonna wanna decide what kind of material that you have around your wood stove. Uh, now I have steel both on the floor below my wood stove and also all the way up the wall. And um, that was the cheapest way for me to do it. But if you have stone or anything else, then that's gonna be a little bit more expensive, right? Uh, the steel was super, super cheap, but the steel that I have is, is cold, right? Like it, it doesn't retain heat, uh, you know, like stone wood, for example. And of course, if you have a wood stove, you're probably gonna need to source wood from somewhere. So a lot of people recommend, you know, um, not sourcing wood more than five miles from where you're gonna burn it. Because if you're sourcing wood from halfway across the country, uh, then, you know, you could bring pests over. Like a lot of bugs and whatnot do live in the wood. Um, so, you know, there's that. Um, and also like if you live in a city, then, you know, do you have to source the wood? Like, are you gonna have to drive out of the city just to, 
to source the wood, like where are you going to get your firewood? Uh, we live in the Rocky Mountains, so <laughs> uh, we source most of our wood um, on the property, but you can also source wood from like anywhere around here basically. <laughs> the only thing about filming in the dark when it's so late is that you folks can't see my like crazy like legging pattern. <laughs> like, I feel like I have crazy pants on like every time I'm filming. 